the last days in the Fatuma. Tao, if I want to give those things, Tao, you don't use leg. Come to see this place again. I know, yeah. So, I have less than one month stay here, but I just stay clean the house. It is just because, just because. So if I don't give those things to open it, I will take carry on. You feel carry on go now? Yes. But if you don't can't give them, Uncle. And that's me, between me and God. No, what is not going to punish me because of you? How? I don't know. And why God takes no say you go and give them? Hey, if I reach there, they will call you. They should not call me. Just give them, just so that somebody is... Somebody say you should just give them. Don't call me. Finito. You can me. So how much have you buy tra travel box? Travel box. This thing. I go buy travel box twenty five k. How much is so Ghana money? Like, like a year What's ago. What's a year ago? Compared to Nigeria situation. It's the fake one, no. Just to use and carry load. Fake one. Mhm. Mm yeah, that means that will be possible. I said fake one. Yes. Okay, how much is original? The thing I will be the uh, the thing I the thing I the thing I the thing I will 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 the thing I Hey, you let me find buyer for this many ones. What I have How much do you buy the bed? How much do you pay? I can't collect one seventy from you. How much do you pay? You be my G. What the fuck? I don't have much I think you should pay. What are I know how much is the head of the bed, ba? I know, I know the bed. <laughs> so, ba? Mm -hmm. I can't say it under, ba? Yeah. Bring 150. No, I need 1,000. You did follow me price market, I will. <laughs> she, hey, ba, me. Yeah, yeah. You got to tell me what I need, yeah. Nigeria situation. Yeah, bring one. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm hmm. 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 Yes. Has the gun? But it's still there. It's still affecting you. When I say you come and do calculation, you have a dick. But then when you to talk about where can I bring the money? Calculation is different from what else you want to buy? But guy, you clean this place well. Look. It's not where that I'm going now. Even though I don't even do thorough big thing. So, Nata, what can you do? Yes. Now, I tell you, let me shop with before you come. That is just adjust to you, adjust to more. Even that 150, where you want this, now my money safe. Sure, you know, if I calculate all my change, all my change, you know, say you don't have to sell that key. Now, even my money, you won't pay me. And I don't feel okay selling that stuff to you. Let me go and move outside that. Because now my money, they pay me back. It comes as I did that shoe. That will just bring to 50k. Because now you. And I again. Mm. You can't remember me all these years. But I never spent six months going here. How about you? Do you have any hands? I said in the day, I So how many? I just told you for so you are going up to 15k. So, someone that has not spent six months, I don't even spend four months. It doesn't matter for me. If I don't want to judge myself, the person will judge regardless. So you say all these years? Mm. You know why they make combo dinner? I mean, it's just for me. 
Hey guys, mm -hmm, now. So yeah, the year we look for joy till now. Then, we get few months for everything is now like looking like it's making sense now, like everything is looking. Like, hmm? That will okay. Don't worry. So it's my final days in Ibadan. <laughs> You know, as much as I'm living, I try to clean the house. This is going to be like my last cleaning in the house before the person that is going to take over is gonna come. So, the thing is, I've actually applied for admission, but I actually applied late. Let me not lie. In fact, I think there's okay, I'll make some screen videos. In fact, admission has actually closed, but Fortunately, it's hard to open the portal again. Remember, I think there's this rush to go into. Guys, like I used to tell you, before you study medicine, eh, know your final destination. It was for me knowing my final destination, I started tracking that, oh, Nigeria medicine cannot be for me. African medicine cannot be for me. I, actually, I was this close. I was even considering Philippines. I wanted to find out that, hmm. There are so many things. They'll just come and tell you study in Philippines, study in Philippines. Nobody is telling you the actual problem that when you graduate that when you want to move to other country, nobody is talking about it because I did not see anybody talking about it. Do you know people that have to talk about it? They have to talk about it in their language or this thing. It was really difficult. So I was just this close to settling for Philippines or any African country. I made a video previously talking about oh I said for Zambia. I was this close. Won't mind just say, Demi, go back again and make that research. Demi, like, it's like, even though where I read going to, like, there are so many things that people don't talk about. Anyways, like I say, stay subscribed on this channel. I'm going to be the editing net tonight. I'm going to be just seeing and talking to you people. And I told you guys, I'm starting from first year. Did I tell you guys? So when I get to my destination, in as much as my school has helped me to start from third year, but I had to start from I hope that was starting from first year. Why? I'll just you guys. And this is because of my future as well. Like I stop it's not about now. In as much as now, it's going to look at oh, I'm spending six years in medical school instead of four years or three years. But I know that the long run, I'll be glad I repeated that class instead of actually making transfer. Because not be your final destination. You feel to transfer me no go for future. Like I say, stay subscribed. So the thing is I've applied for admission now. I'm waiting for my invitation letter. So and the invitation letter takes maybe like thirty to forty days. So in that thirty to forty days, I'm just trying to pack my stuff. You guys can hear when I was telling you to help me with box, the things I can pack from Nigeria and you know I'll be traveling to Abuja to I don't know to actually apply for my visa. So the thing is, once I'm leaving in Badu, I'm leaving finally. I am not coming back. So I'll go to Abuja. And the thing is, I've checked for my flight. Before I have checked for my flight, everything. So I was able to check. So it was even from the flight, I was able to deduce whether I should come back to Badu or I should fly from there. But checking everything, checking plus and minus, seeing this, I be research queen now. Nah. You didn't whine me. You didn't whine. You didn't whine. I be research queen. So you know, things like that. So I just had to screenshot all these different parts here. Okay, which one be cheaper? Then I realized that oh, let me just fly from there. So, this is my last day in the battle, and I came here 2021 or 2022 or 2020 or about. And trust me, Ibadan has been the amazing part. Like, it is when I came to Ibadan, I was able to figure out my life. Because I don't know if I will see you posting that picture like when I had my supermarket when like it was like the world was against me. Ah, he lay bad or bad or so my bad the days they took that like <sighs> but it was really worthwhile for me. It it was really luck and then the luckiest thing happened when I moved to this house, like everything just moved on a faster lane. And I told you guys that if anyone told me I'll be going back to school this year, I'll argue, let alone live in Nigeria. I'll watch Nigeria. But it was just so, but it was just, was just everything to me. Like, I don't know, I'll be sharing my experience. If I ever get to live again in Nigeria, it is going to be a bad, a bad so i'm grateful to Ibadan for making my life the best i can ever imagine in nigeria 
if I don't feel fun, nice. If I don't feel fun, you know, like they have squishy in their head, but they are the nicest, most receptive people I've ever met in my entire life. Throughout I was here, um, I did not talk with my family, I'm just alone. But the people I call family at this my vibe and people I see around, the security guard, okay, even when you take Okada, like the spirit is I don't know which other place you can live if it's not a bad. I don't know. Like or oh, let me just say the Jova tribe. Jova tribe has been because I've stayed in other parts, right? I stayed in Abuja, I stayed in the east, I stayed in the west. The most part I've ever felt welcomed, like welcome, but the people inside the people inside the house is the bottom, is the western side of it. This is just me talking from my own experience, yo, from my own experience. I would tell people to the try. all those that are okay, they try. I would tell people to are nice, but the one with the warmest reception is the bottom. Two bad people is that people that you can ask, please. I'm going to one place, they can almost take you there with their hand. The auntie be telling Lonnie, the bottom people, like, I don't know. Which other place would you want to be? Like, if 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 you, I don't even know how to describe this. These guys are amazing. These guys are. You guys know that it was because of bad on people at the time. If I felt like I'll be traveling out, I was like, I'm not going to leave. That that and I've been saying it. If you get maybe my video or to my friends that anything that is going to make me to leave a on that means I'm living in Nigeria. Nothing is going to make me leave this abandon. And I tried, I tried, I don't leave it abandon. And I've said it, anything that is going to make me leave it I am not, I'm leaving Nigeria to that. But it is the best thing that has ever happened to me. Ibadan and Ibadan people. They are the best thing that has ever happened to me. I've never met people as selfless as. In fact, if I don't do it, they will use niceness, won't you? Sometimes when they will be nice to you, be like, wait, you won't use me for ritual? Like, why are you this nice? Because we are the, or let me just say, you're a bad tribe in general. We are just nice to a difference. Our ask one of you, but we're just nice, like, effortlessly nice. And then the nicest tribe is Ibadan. Please give them their crown. Thank you very much. So, it's been a regular cost of information, almost three years in Ibadan. And now, it's time to go to the next heavy to be done. Is it like, like I am now? I don't want to say some things. If somebody will actually tell me that, wow, I'll be traveling to Nigeria and need to be safe, so I'm okay, are you kidding me? Like, I don't worry, when I get to where I'm going, <laughs> I'll make a video and tell you guys how much I was actually able to save up, how much I had in my account if I traveled, how much I planned for my You guys will be so surprised. You guys. Would be so amazed. So leaving this place, the gents was like, "It's gonna refund me." When I was leaving, you know, Nigerian gents wanted to come with us. Then, maybe I'll make a separate video that they will not refund. Anyways, so what's next? Maybe by tomorrow. Yeah, I think tomorrow I'll start making move. Like tomorrow, I'll get it banned to go and get dollar card. I don't know how that is really going to work. So I've written some my things of things I have to do. And the thing is, I don't want to carry a load. I need clothes. Clothes is cheap. The thing that I need is food. So even if I'm going from Ibadan to Abuja, right? I will not carry a load. The only thing I'm just going to carry is things that I know say I know fit for Abuja. So when I get to Abuja, I'll be staying in a service apartment, and then I'll be doing all this food stuff like how cook plenty snails, dry it, dry goat's milk, suja. Ah, Kilishi. Ah, you see those things that used to make sense. Gary Jebu. I don't know whether I should buy Gary Jebu. In the bottle. In a butcher. I don't know. So that's the little thing that is going to see in my load. If you guys heard me in my video, most of my clothes, I'm going to be giving it to the motherless baby some orphan. Like you guys said in the video, sure. I'll be giving that. So I'm not carrying plenty of clothes like that. Right? But I'm actually still contemplating. If I should keep that my second house, I have a second house in the middle. If I should keep it so that when I come every year to Nigeria, I'll just stay in the house. I'm actually still thinking. Basically. I think. Anyways, let's see how it goes. And if you have something like that. Well guys, thanks so much for watching today's video. I'll see you guys next time. Bye for now.